Welcome back to our channel, where we keep you updated with the latest in the music industry. Today we're diving into the recent drama between Big Sean and Kanye West. Big Sean took some shots at Kanye in a new freestyle on On The Radar Radio, and we're here to break it all down for you. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more exclusive content from the Red Carpet Reup. Big Sean's freestyle over Aaliyah's classic hit, If Your Girl Only Knew, has everyone talking. He started by seemingly addressing Kanye's past comments about him. Remember when Kanye called signing Sean to good music the worst thing he ever did on Drink Champs in 2021? Well, Sean rapped. I had to switch the home team because they committed treason. Niggas looking for engagement like they got their knee bent. I got better things to do than to find someone to beef with. Let's take a closer look at these lyrics. Sean is clearly referencing Kanye's derogatory remarks and implying that he's moved on from those days. The line about looking for engagement seems to criticize people, possibly Kanye, for seeking attention in controversial ways. Sean didn't stop there. He continued with a broader critique of the music industry. Man, this industry is terrible. I can't even vouch I've seen grown men get matching tattoos for the clout. This seems like a direct jab at Kanye, Lil Uzi Vert, and Steve Lacey, who got matching tattoos in 2022. This tattoo incident was widely covered in the media, and Sean's lyric highlights the lengths some artists go to for publicity. By calling out these actions, Sean is positioning himself as above these gimmicks focusing on his music instead. Despite the drama, Sean paid tribute to Detroit legends Aaliyah and Jay Dilla during his performance. He also clarified that his bars weren't aimed at Kendrick Lamar, despite ongoing rumors of their feud. DJ had confirmed on Twitter that Sean's line, I got better things to do than find someone to beef with, was not about Kendrick, but directed at another Gemini, hinting towards Kanye. Sean himself addressed the freestyle on social media, emphasizing that his focus is on the music and dismissing the haters. So there you have it. Big Sean's freestyle has reignited old tensions with Kanye, while also shining a light on his dedication to his craft and respect for Detroit legends. It's clear Sean wants to keep the focus on his music, and we can't wait to hear more from him especially with his upcoming album and collaborations. Thanks for tuning in to The Red Carpet Reup. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, share, and subscribe for more exclusive content. See you next time.